Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today I will be continuing the Ast What if Asta was the son of Fawn and Igneo? And where we last left off in part 2.75 was when Asta had gotten captured by the elves. Or as we didn't know that there were elves yet, but well, we knew it, so I don't care if you if I spoiled shit for you now. But yes, because he got captured by the elves when after the fight with Licht uh, to try to save the children and all that. As uh, Aesir got really really mad and frustrated and also sad that she had lost her son that he got have gotten captured. That was where we left off. So let's now get into the what if. Let's now we'll pick up where we left. We in Aesir's and the Noel's perspective, as they were all just like, no, this can't be. He's, he's, he's captured. No. As they all began to feel like, it's impossible. No, 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 no. Asyami was also extremely shocked that Asta lost. <laughs> And now we will begin to get to the Eye of the Midnight Sun's perspective. As they arrived at their secret base, the Floating Stone, where they got Asta. As Asta was still, like, conscious but couldn't move, he was restrained by some magic. And Fauna, the, the elf that... The, the human named Fauna was there, looking at him. He said, it's a okay, son. You're home. And Asta just tried to raise up, and he actually managed to do it this time. He said, you're not my mom. <laughs> you just have her name and share her memories. You're not my mom. As she would say. I know what you don't remember. You were only an infant. Probably, but you know who, you're, who I am. You read the letter that was in the bag. As so, so we'll of just like, she really shares my mother's memories. Even though she's human, though she still shares her name. As she said, I am actually an elf. And Asta said, No, you're not. Look, just look at your ears. They are not pointy at all. As Asta would hear a voice from his scream, he Asta heard a voice from his scream. Or said, "It is her. It really is her." As he did not know what it was, he thought it was his con uh, unconsciousness. But then Asta tried to. S stand up and go away, but suddenly he felt some magic restraining him, and he immediately. F he, but the magic didn't affect him; it just f forbid him from leaving this place. He could not move more than that. <laughs> she was captured. He did not know where he was. She could not send any signal either. As he suddenly felt something inside his head, felt something, and then he suddenly just fell asleep. As Fawn would say, Asta, Asta, what happened? As he would be asleep now. Because he was so extremely exhausted from the fight, and it started to begin now. So, uh, Fawn would just wonder, what the hell happened? As she would lift him up and let him into the bed. And so she would just keep watching over him. I swear I would also come and check on him and wonder what happened because he wasn't supposed to be knocked out. But since, it, since she said, it's probably from the fight. I said, oh, said yeah, that's getting true. As now Raya and Licht also come to see Asta. But he was asleep though. They didn't know what to do. They healed his wounds, but they sealed him with magic so he couldn't move. 
out from this room. Yeah, so he wouldn't try to escape until I reincarnated everything and cast a spell on him. I still would have found a mage that hated the Claw Kingdom that it had mind control magic. Or not mind control, it was like controlling magic or something. So he would be like a puppet for Fauna. I guess the the mage could do that so a certain person was the one that had the control of another person. So it will take two months for him before he would wake up. And now we will switch back to another perspective as the all the captains and all that came. As that was there at the fight. Yes, we're still shocked as they left there. And we made a report to the Wizard King as the Wizard King was really sad and Surprised and also confused by how Arthur could get captured. Oh yes, I almost forgot to mention that they s in the f in the part two what ifs. I forgot to mention that the the Alfana al uh, the Fana also revealed that Arthur was the son of the Fire Dragon King, Igniel. That was one of the factors that made him be so shocked that he could get captured. So everyone's still surprised that he so he's the son of a dragon. I still would be surprised. But now let's get back to the Black Bolt's view. As Noel, Juno, who just realized and just wanted to go off directly, but easier. And Captain Yami stopped and said, No, you can't. We have to do what we can to stop them. I have to send a founder brace first. As now it will begin to dungeon arc. And now everything will be slowed down like a month. So the dungeon arc happened a month later. As now not just Vero will go there, but Fauna and the. No, but Vero and Raya would go there. As this time, because they really wanted to secure the stones now, fast to as they as Noel still would have managed to master the new spell that she got there, but now she didn't have that swimsuit to impress Asta because Asta was captured, and also I forgot to mention that. Uh, <laughs> Nero wasn't with Asta. She was with her Black Bulls. Because she left when the fight began. And she also began to feel kind of sad or so because she had remained. She, she didn't want to admit it or something. Because she had been softened up and wasn't just as cold to, against Asta anymore. Because Asta knew that she wasn't just a bird. She had transformed the talk to him sometimes. As the, for the dungeon arc, they would go kind of the same until Vero appears. Vero appears, yes, and, and Raya would hide. So, if they had needed to go escape immediately, as yes, everything would go the same except for Noel would still unlock the drug, sea dragon Seror spell, but Vero would actually, she wouldn't, he wouldn't kill her, but he would knock her out and knock everyone out. And he would found he would have found the magic stone before Jami. As at the same time was about to escape when Jami managed to break out from through the barrier with Stark Dimension Slash. As would say as Vero would say, I'd really like to play some more but it's time I have to go now. As Raya quickly opened a portal and teleported them away to the base. And yes, I know the de dungeon arc wasn't as detailed, but it's because Asta is captured. And now, actually, they would go back to the Eye of the Midnight Sun space. As so they would give Luke the stone and to reset it on the tablet and realize that there's only three left. One in the Black Bull's hideout as they fought, but Asta really had it in his pockets, but they didn't know that. And two that and one that the Wizard King had, and the last one didn't know where it was. 
because it was Yuna that had that one. And yes, in this one, it wasn't actually the devil that the one controlled the humans. They, they, or yes, it actually it was. I changed that. Take it back. As the barrel for the Clover Kingdom started to get nearer, as the Black Boss reported that they failed, but Vero didn't kill anyone, he just knocked all of them out and escaped and made it as Yami Kang. And, and he got the magic stone. Julius was really mad at this, but he realized that they didn't really stand a chance when Asta was gone, because he was the only one. Except for Jamu that could ha have helped them in that battle. As he began to think, what should he do now? As he Vero would still immobilize Kahuno and uh, Keiro. I think his name was. No, Kiaro. Yes, that was the name. That they would still be immobilized. Like, Kiaro would lose his leg and Kahuno would lose her singing. Because they wanted to be idols and they had both dancing and singing magic each. As uh, the, they would, Noel and the Juno and them would still want to help their friends to get their dreams back. As they went to the Queen of Witch Forest after some advices. And here it will begin that where Asta comes in. As he will be the one to, with Thana to attack them. And which for his queens of witches. As Vanessa would still head out there first. Because she wanted to like Kyoto and Kahuna. And then Nohal went to. Oh god, I forgot his name. But it's that red hair diamond which that likes to strip. He was the one that taught Asta sword magic. Her sword scales. Yes, but. She got to him and and uh, his girlfriend or wife, I don't know really the relationship there. And she would have told them um, about the Queen of Witches, and they would tell her that Vanessa was the first one to go. Maybe the, it was there that she went. As uh, she would say that it was a, a really bad news because, uh, according to rumors, Vanessa was really important to the Witch Queen. As they all went there, like everything played out the same except for that Juno was the one to replace Asta until they get to the Witch Queen. And she would tell Asta because Asta wasn't there at all. And we would make a dream that if they defeated the enemy, defeated the intruders, she would help them to get that blood to heal them, their friends. I just realized the, the Diamond Kingdom attacked. I stand they saw that the After Midnight Sun also attacked. And then I saw something that it was Fauna, and then that Asta was there too. As Asta's flame spirit had been grown to that half, I don't know, second form. And become that huge. And they saw also that Asta had something weird on. Weird. It was something weird with Asta. He once had wings and scales, as Noel remembered about the wings, but she didn't know that he got grow scales, but she thought it would make sense that since he was the son of a dragon, but they were confused that he was helping them. And this spell won't be so easily broken, as they first took care of the diamond kingdom made diamond mages, but they couldn't take care of that, uh, I don't know. What it is. Um, I don't know who the name was, but yeah, you know the guy that had that magic ability to absorb magic and release it and all that. They couldn't defeat him. And then yes, Asta, ordered by Fauna, Fauna said, Take care of the diamond mage. Yes, mother. As he would say, jump down, or no, he would fly down to it. As he, he would tell the flame fire spirit to still pro protect mom for me. 
stood for the spirit in it because the flame spirit didn't know what was good and it was evil because it just followed the one that it like shows. So also would fight the diamond mage and this would be one extremely one city from the start because the diamond mage didn't stand a chance against Lostal. He was much faster and more combat adaptive and combat skilled. He was a real genius in the battlefield. So he would easily he wouldn't he kill he also would easily kill that guy and take his magic items and burn his grimoire. Oh right, there was no need to burn that grimoire because he didn't have one and two it would just disintegrate when the person was dead. I still almost shocked that Asta acted so so then also returned to his Fahana directly after the order. It, the, the, the order is done. And she knew that if he went too close to Asta, no, to Noel and the Juno, she realized that the spell might be broken or they might capture him. And she ordered him to stay close to her and don't go near them. As she pointed at the black poles, she asked would say, Yes. Mom. We just follow her as they, they try to attack her, but Asta has used his fire magic to defend him off. And when he set the forest on fire, and the only way after stunned at the witch queen hand, as Nero would be there too with them because she followed Noel and you not now. Since Asta wasn't there. And she would pick the witch queen off the stone. So someone managed to steal it without her. No, she would not manage to steal it actually. She would just pick her with it. And the, the witch queen would realize that there's something with this bird. Something familiar. Which she would have realized. Because she, the witch queen was actually friends with human once. And it was Sekrei and Lumiere that she was friend with, she was Sekrei? Is that you? She probably did not. And she would say, oh, you want a magic stone? She, the witch queen would give it to Nero. And she never quickly flew to Noel and Juno. And she picked, and the, picked them and said, and the, acted like they needed to retreat now. And the Asta and Fauna didn't know that the stone wasn't there, that Nir had taken it already as the Black Bells retreated. When Asta realized because of his genius that said to his mother, something is wrong, why would they retreat? Because or why would they be here? Did they found a stone already? As far would say, no, they have. Alright, we'll just have to burn this forest, as they burned the forest down. Until they fought the witch queen, and the witch queen came out of the burrow. And this time, Fauna and Asta battled side by side with the flame spirit. As the witch queen said that flame spirit was extremely strong. With that high intense more and it wasn't even it's in its complete form. I'd like to say that when the f I have a surprise for the flame spirit's complete form. She would, she would be surprised at it and say, use her blood mirror to try to fight. But she didn't stand a chance against the Fawn and Asta. As they used to come from what we call the fire dragon. Or fire creation ma fire magic. Phoenix robe is dr and that's just fire dragon creation magic fire dragon salamander as it would be like a boosted upgrade for the slime spirit as it would get bigger and get some more scales and not be so like orange like it would grow more red as this is just a pow temporary power up and this just said fire dragon king's roar as he unlocked a new spell, and Sandmander, the flame, he would no, it would be flame spirit magic, fire dragon king's roar, as the f fire dragon would roar, as the flames, no, the fire, f the flame spirit would just roar, as the witch queen would be taken out.
And they thought she died, but she didn't. Because they didn't know where her grimoire was, and they thought it just had already disintegrated, but it actually it was in her hat. Sirius left back to the base. And when little heard they see her that oh no, they they got the more magic stones, so we need to attack the black bot's hideout. And the wizard king will pro or the wizard king have them. This would be an emergency meeting with the captains on the situation that they need to get Asta back as Licht would be there. And yes, Licht would still have that injured arm. But it wouldn't be shown because she had like... Something to hide it before too. As they would just go there. As Licht would transform to Vanyas again and get got to the meeting. With the captains, and because now they would have actually managed to dispel that if me um, what is now uh, memories protection spell on the captives from the attack on the capital, so they would have managed to dispel it, and would have gotten out that the purple orcus captain was a traitor, but I don't knew that yet. As after all that, because the purple orcs captain would get captured by rail. After that, uh, um, Vonius would immediately leave. After his summer, because he thought, he knew, he then sensed from the Wizard King's art that he had magic stones on him. So he thought that he needed to. As Lichter would thought in his head, as Vonius would have heard this, like, we, uh, we need to kill him. As uh, one said, yes, but I have t I need time to think of this. Because he's just as good. He's my best friend. He's like the one that made me all this possible too. So you don't have to choose between. I have to choose between you and he him. I need time to think. As Slickwood said, yes. You know I will leave you alone until then. As they would return to the mid I have the midnight sun's place. As now Asta would still dispel the mind control spell would weaken a little because Asta saw you and I and all I felt those feelings for them for them because they had such a close connection. As he started to get on a rampage. As it, as Fun would tell Vero and Raya to help restrain Asta again. We see he magic went up to the roof and went on a rampage. Just like knots I've done in the fairy tale series. And now um let's just say that he managed to somehow unlock his demon for his it wouldn't look his devil form wouldn't look exactly like this, it would just be a half dra a dr he would unlock dragon force now. A starter was at this. It wasn't dragon force. It was just his drag normal dragon form. But now we were unlike the dragon something similar to dragon force, and it would look kind of like this. Like half his side was. He would. He wouldn't completely unlock the dragon force, but he would unlock the half of it, and he would kind of look similar to the dev devil black Asta, but it would be red haired. And his hair was all red, but he would grow scales almost completely on his left side and grew a wing and his arm would and leg would change to scales and he would have claws. So he tried to restrain him, they said, we, we can't restrain him completely. Quick, quick, get that mind image here over, as well as Licht, as Licht would appear immediately and said, help them to restrain him. But uh, they couldn't restrain Asta completely, as they ch then they had no choice but to fire him. As Fonda said, I, I can't fire him. As li they would understand that, because she didn't want to hurt her own son. As they all <laughs> managed to somehow knock Asta out, she then would fall asleep. For... I don't know, he would still fall asleep now. And he would sleep long, long, long. 
as they were trying to force the mind, co the mind magic to control him. Uh, to found out, ex made it extremely strong and have some reinforcement magic stones on both of them to not sever the connection between them so easily. So it would be harder for this time for them, for the black bulls to make it out. But yes, as now. We switched to the owner's perspective as they would have heard everything from the purple orcus captain. Oh, well, it was before Licht appeared again. But yes, now, so. I don't really know what to say more. Wait, let me think. Um. Oh, yes, they would get the. It would be the star ceremony now. Yeah. Yeah, it was the source anymore because it came up this time. As they would say that they have discovered the base of. As they would say that the Black Bulls was the second place after Golden Dawn. Or actually, it would be a tie between those two. As, yeah, I, mean, I would love to. Uh, too bad that kid isn't here though. As everyone would be sad again and remember that Asta was captured because Asta was the one, mainly the one that had gotten the most stars. But Juno and all contributed as well. As, uh, the Yam would still would it be there with the captains to show respect or they wouldn't send up anyone either because um, the Instagram will understand why. They would, you would understand why, because they missed Arthur too much, so they don't want to show their faces. They were too depressed. They couldn't be happy about this. As uh, the Clover King would then appear and tell them the speech that he had discovered the, lo ha the, the location of the hideout of the Eye of the Minute Sun, but they, and they would need a special task force called the Royal Knights. And now, uh, everyone will talk about this. And yes, in this version of Black Clover, the king wouldn't be such a douchebag and he would actually respect commoners and all that. It's now, um, what to say? Oh, yes, um, Noel and Juno would still talk and go down the stairs there even though they weren't up there. Hold on wait a minute. So they would still go down the stairs as I said and see that Merleona was beating up kinda of beating them up of about uh, what hap but uh, they got fifth place and the back walls was first place. Even though it weren't make much sense since she knew Asta and you know and all that. And well, as they would quickly discover this and Leopold would see it, I would say, look at him and said, please help. As they would say, nah, we are about to leave with the look, but nah. As Merlona would notice them with the man and said, and where are you going? She would grab the lion paws and just take them and said, you're going with us on the training camp. As Nell would have said, no, no, we're not. And Yuna said, what do I have to do with this? What the hell did you get yourself into? As they would go to the volcano, and this time, um, Merleona would capture Captain Jami. He was still bare drinking, but of depression. As the other captains knew why he was so depressed and so sad. As Aisha would also drink with him, and she rarely drank. And no, but now she drank because she was in. She wasn't leaving the soul by his side now because she was afraid that he would be taken too or killed. She didn't want to lose anyone more. Um, as they would all get captured by Merleona, except for Aisha because she would counter. Counter Mariona's lion paw, and then I saw so Noel and you know they would say hi, hi mom, and she would say S and sigh and say, 
I guess I will come to you with this training. I need to get stronger to save my son. I still want a volcano. It won't. It would want all the same way, except for that. Noel would not have any struggle with controlling Hermana's skin. Now, and Churchill defeated that lava base, and they would get to the top. And join the hot springs. So. Stay relaxed here, and after that they will go to the magic enter, magic royal magic knights entrance exam. But the black bulls wouldn't need to fight because they already selected which one would be there, and the black bulls didn't want to fight there because of their pressure that Asta wasn't there to compete. And yeah, I don't really know what to say more. So yes, look, the match sets would want the same, kind of. Mimosa and Sora, Sora, I think the mask guy would be on the same team. I, and uh, it would have been duos now. Asike and uh, Longress. Oh yeah, some of the Black Bulls actually competed. Those two were Finroll and Magna. And luck. As luck would end up with real, and I know that it wasn't on, in, on their team in the last fight, but because I want to put them together because they look so familiar, similar, and I actually think that even though it was a said in the series that they were kind of related in when they were elves, but they look so similar and have similar attitudes, and they look so young for their age. They're both 19, I think. They would be on their team. Magna would be with the t Earth Golem uh, Woman from the Blue Rose Knights. As uh, that irritating vice captain of the Pile of Peacocks, Melissa Sparta wouldn't be accepted in the their set in a team. Let's see now. I have Longress and the Baja guy. So then it was. Finroll and uh, I don't know what to say. Uh, oh yeah, let's just say that Vanessa also teamed up. She would be with it would be Finroll, Vanessa, Longress and Baja guy. Um oh yeah, I remember what the Earth one from Romantic Norse Knight her name is Soul and Magna and Mimosa and that Sora guy. Those would be the four to compete. As the other ones would be too depressed and sad about Asta to even put up a fight. As the first match would be between... Oh no, I will take away, like... Let us say that... Uh, Luck wasn't able to... F wasn't allowed to fight with us. You would just go berserk. Yes, instead of Luck team up with Trill, it would be actually, um, who would it be? Yeah, it would be Mimosa's brother. Let's say that. But they team up with Trill, and they would come up with a phoenix level called Painting Rose. Petals, as they would paint an arena, and then he would use his rose uh, petal magic to just create that beautiful rose field. As the Whisk King would be amazed by it, but he wouldn't show his sparkling eyes because he was too close he was too close to us to be happy now. As in the first fight it would be Mimosa and Sora versus Rail and uh, Mimosa's brother. As Sora and Mimosa would win that fight and go to the final symmetry because I, I will take away some teams that I do not want. Yes, then it would be the match against uh, between um, Magna and uh, actually um, uh, Magna and Soul versus Finroy and Vanessa. As in this fight, it was a close battle, and then Sol got knocked out, and 
funeral too. After a while, this would just be Vanessa versus Magna this time, and this this would be extremely close. But Vanessa would win because she was actually drunk, and this at the end. Let's just say that one, and and let's just say that one. Uh, Vanessa is drunk. She get a boost power up and. And actually managed to beat him. And so now she will get that fate. Uh, cat. So this may be the only thing to dispel the spell that Asta has now on him. And so they will try to attack the hideout. But now, um, let us see. What to say? Um, yes, it's the magic knight. The thing. Final would be between Vanessa, Finral versus Sora and Mimosa. As this fight would be a draw because they would both destroy um the crystals at this exact same time. Smurlic Knight has just ex enters exam would end there and everyone that was present except for Asta then Everyone that was the Royal Knights in Cairnhold would be accepted to the Royal Knights. Except for Asta because he was captured. And this time that Shadow Spy would actually spy them from another Shadow so he would be detected. But this, as they was their eating and the Mer Merleon would say that they will attack the base in. Five days. A shadow would hear this and he realized that that wasn't true. As he followed them, uh, followed Merlion up to the roof where it was in the cell and Aesir too. As the target, we are not gonna go and fight this, we're gonna attack them tomorrow. As the shadow would he barely hear this one, he tried to run away, but Merlion would capture him. But before uh, she he could she could knock her out him out he would actually send a message to say that to to let you say that um Fauna was the closest one. It said that they would attack tomorrow. As she would know they stand and warn everyone that they will attack t tomorrow morning. As they somehow found out where our base is. I started to move the base as well as actually moving Asta out from the base to another place and with Fauna. It's now basically the fight to be split up in the same teams except for instead of Asta, um, except for some machines in the team like Acer will be with Juno, Noel, and uh, Merleona. Sauron wouldn't be directly with them, he would be with another group. But everything would wait the same until the elves reincarnation. You see, yeah. because now, actually, Yavo said Cabral saw that at least they would, as Captain Vahangens would get to, the wizard can speak to him. And tell him that he was happy and all that about the story that exactly the same he told in the in canon. As then they would start a battle, and the, but first he would say that, but I also had another soul in me. As he said, that I can't choose between you, so you have to sell this between yourself. As he would soul switch, as they were the technique that he knew. So Lick would now take form and his hair and face would change from the scar and all that. So we get on the fight as the, the woods is really close now because Julius was furious at him. So he would try to get back Asta by beating so he fought harder than before. And Lick tried to really because he cared about Asta and and he wanted to protect Asta and awake his true elf. Inside him because it was somehow sealed away with the time travel. So they would uh, 
if that weren't the same and here and let will uh, start activate that immense silhouette ultimate magic light sword spell as it would rain down when Zeus would use the gigantic chrono something time spell so reverse it but this time Lich would actually kill him as Yestas and Cannon and Jamba would come there precisely see exactly come up to see when exactly when Lich killed the whiskey as the whiskey would then smile and then just fall down dead as Lich would just grab the three stones then he would just go to the stones in the harsh village and under the demon skull and actually resurrect the elves as now in the battle now we are switching to the hideout base as the everyone that had elf reincarnations with axe spells would activate but you know since you know was half human half elf he would still be in control but everyone else would be elves and they needed to retreat as Aesir said to Merlina, no, he's not here. I can't sense his mana. I can't sense the sense the human that took him either. I can't no, he, she would say him or she would, I can't sense that other girl that took him either. There must be another place. Damn it! I still would have to retreat now. As they all did. And it's not that they, they it moved to the capital, but they needed to heal everyone was in shock and lot they couldn't just patch Murray because the space on Mitch would be enough as well. So Jami would then switch back to Yami where Marks and that healing mage would come to them. As they, exactly when the start was about to start healing, the wizard king, the, uh, the elf form awakened. As they will just start to attack Yami, as Yami will use his dark, his dark protection spell to protect the, the Wizard King's body, and Salt would still be there to protect it. And instead, there's a hero side go and protect it and hide it somewhere. As everything went the same, they relay. And then we switch back to Asta and the. Uh, Fauna as also would still be asleep, but when the elf spell you activated and Fauna would turn to an elf No, and the human soul from Fauna's body would actually disappear Because I chat I have done enough I have to go now As Fauna would return to her elf form and her elf body Because she, they actually had her real body, it was intact As now they would go and Asta would just, as the medic went to Asta, it wasn't just his elf form that was awakened, it was his seed dragon form as well. As now, um, he would just awake and he started to glow more kind of reddish and still yellow as well. It's kind of look. I don't know how to explain but it would be reddish and yellow. It wouldn't be orange at all, it would just be reddish and yellow. Because his dragon form would start to awaken and he started to grow some scales. And we'll get those line on his face. And the pointer ears got even more pointier as his memories would return everything. And when he, he the, the mind spell would broke but also would still be con somehow. Since he was half dragon and half elf, wait a minute. As he uh, was well, half, he, as I said, half elf and half dragon. He wouldn't be human, so like he would still have some memories of Noel and Juno, but they would suppress none or see the way in his mind. And she said, "Hunger, mom said, Mom, it's really you." said yes and now we have realized so they say it's time but she would say time for what to to end humans as I said 
Yes, mom. I still would go to the battlefield as well as Solomon will be waiting for him. And now, when Asa's, Asa's dragon form and elf form was awakened, the Solomon had started to change. It will grow bigger and bigger. And it wouldn't be such a... Because the salamander, like second stage, would be kinda see-through, but not really. Uh, so now, um, uh, yeah, uh, as it would change and start growing, and now it would turn into, it would look exactly like Igning, except for no scars. It's now Igni's soul awoken from. There grew more. No, uh, no, 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 no. Igni still would it be there because he would stop them from attacking the humans. Because, but no, in this what if, it, that wouldn't happen. So, uh, yes, Igni's soul wouldn't be anywhere because he would have died back then. So. The flame sprout changed to that dragon, it was in its true form now. So they would go and ride with some other, with like, very well ride because they would have arrived there to escort them as well, to the capital, as they burned villages down on the way. If they would now come to the capital and start to wreak havoc, as Yama would see that. What is that thing? Is that a dragon? Is that what said us since Asa's key? It said the kids here. But wait, it's elves. It's it's the others. But the key, and their mom is so massive. And said Asa realized that Asa's mom went for the roof as well. Say, was that dragon? It turned something weird. Wait, is that Asa's flame spirit? I realized and sensed the key from. He couldn't sense the key, so he sensed the mon and sensed that mon was extremely familiar with the flame spirit, but it was much, much, much stronger. It was like 30 times stronger than before in its first form. Because, no, it not in its first form, it was like, let's say, 150 times stronger than its first form and 30 times stronger than its second form. Yeah, as uh, hmm. uh, wait, no, not for the time stronger than its f second form. It's it looks to say that it's 150 times stronger than its second form. It's now an attack the capital and pre fire. As uh, fun with also to you should you should we should just stay on the track and the flame spirit for now. So, I was about to say the same, because why would we go down and bar them? As Yama would use, as they would say that Yama was there. Asta's head would be start to, Asta would start to get ahead of it, because some of his memories starting to break free a little bit. So I found the only pain and agony, so, ah, 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 my head. As the memories would be contained recently as, where I had to use, because he had somehow managed to get the hand of Merc, his hand on Merc's mind magic. As so he was able to seal some memories away for extremely good night, as so his headache would disappear and said, What was that headache for? Just would say, We don't know. Because they don't want him to let him know, because if they told him what it was before, it may bury like, the spell. As the area of the capital began, no, continued. And now, the shadow palace and all that won't take place at all. Because the devil or the hell broken free from it. Because it somehow managed to get the hands on Juno Stone and went and resurrected and went out from the shadow powers and came to their world but it didn't found a suitable it didn't kind of find a body to take over and then he just got killed by Jama with dark dimension slash 
because now the elves will still be like fierce on the humans because in this what if Sagard would only give less like tell the humans where the elves were and so and they would have to attack the humans as or the royals would attack them except for like Lumir would just when it excited us he would defend try to help the elves and all he was like one of the last friends they had As now, Jonas' elf form will start elf form and actually start to take over him more and more. So there's control over his, his parents and ah, as you know, will just faint right in the middle of the flight to the capital. I said ah, before I said ah, ah, what is this? And then he just woke up. And now this was the elf, so I said that the humans, the humans will pay for what they did. She really straight to attack them, but no, but they realized what it was that his elf form was taking control of him, as they had to knock him out completely. As if she were happy doing this, so the other did it for her. As you know, would lose his elf so because it was leave him. And just, um. As all elves would gather in the capital now to begin the onslaught with the humans. There. It's just a big, big problem. As Austin now would see that. Since his cousin, you know, because let's just say that it was kind of like his cousin's, you know, elf soul was starting to leave his body. As the senses said, No, mom, this sense is too. And she would say, What? And then she started to feel that, No, no, as you know, elf soul was about to leave, but then they arrived to the capital, and due to all the intense elf mana was there. The soul got replaced in Juno's body. And uh, now some unknown elf used their magic to just like capture Juno, take Juno off that thing, and take them with them to the others in the giant base that was floating. As this is where we'll be leaving off this what if. I hope you like, guys. Uh, everyone enjoy this video please like and subscribe and click the notification bell if you enjoyed and if you want if you want to tell me what other word if I could do please just comment and tell me that in the comments below and yeah I hope you enjoyed this video bye also remember black clover never give up <laughs>